this closed location that we're not going to reveal. It is a very old cemetery, like 1700s, 1800s, early 1900s. We are fixing to do our prayer that we do before we start any investigation to the planet, those above and below us, to the ones that has walked this path and the path we are about to walk, to the property we are about to enter, and to who once resided or even worked here. To all those that hear and echo my voice, we are only here to talk. We come with only good hearts and blessings, and we mean no harm or disrespect. I ask that our Creator, I ask that the universe, I ask that the light protect us from all that means us harm. We do have some anointing oil that we will also put on us for protection. I'm and getting me double. That's the camera. <laughs> Over. <laughs> That's Coco, by the way. Isn't she a sweetheart? <laughs> and to introduce ourselves, of course, I'm Mystical Love and Light. I'm Rochelle. This is Coco. And this Annette. is Annette. There you go. <laughs> okay. You go. And you can go ahead and. Okay, so we're fixing to go into the location that is a very old, old cemetery. Um, trying to see which is the best way to go in. And that's already in there. What's the spider? Be careful because this is a very, very old cemetery. We have already apologized to everyone here because we can't make heads or tails of what this we must the head or the tail. The feet. I have during our safety walk, we have during our safety walk, we have placed some of our devices around. And as we get closer, we will go over what they are. Um, we're going to make our way over here. There is a candle that I need to light. The wind is starting to pick up. Spirits can, for anybody watching, spirits can drink, can use the um, the flame from the camera, and they can pull more energy from a flame than they can from any device that we have. But I need to sit this someplace else because the wind was starting to pick up. Let's see here. Where can I put it? Where can I put it? Where? Over here? Um, well, I'm sure the wind blows in too. Let's see. Okay, that's pretty flat. Let's see here. What about... Uh, well, let's see. No. Um... 
that big one right over there. Let's try that. Maybe, maybe all the trees and everything will block the wind. Could set it right there. Mm -hmm. Too close to the weeds. She's gonna have a lip right. candle. I'll just hold it. If we find some other place, I'll put it somewhere. Okay, if there are any spirits, which obviously this is a cemetery, we know there's spirits here, but if there's any spirits that want to communicate, do you have that on? Yes, I do. Okay. Can you hold it up so the camera can catch it? There you go. That is an EMF reader. If there's any spirits in here, can you please make that go off that is in Annette's hand? Can you make it go up to the other colors? Either the yellow or the red? We also have a flashlight. That green popped up in one of the trees. Where did we put the flashlight? It's over, over there somewhere. Wait, over there? I'm lost. It was. I thought it was over here. Yeah, I'm lost. We propped a flashlight up in one of the trees. Um, if you would like to communicate, can you turn the flashlight on? So we can so find we, it. So we, <laughs> we can know where find it. Oh, right it could be you, Dex. I know. <laughs> it's a motion ball. <laughs> if you can touch that and wiggle it around or even knock it out of the tree, it will set it off. So the flashlight, where did we put the flashlight? Right there. Right there. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. So, here is the flashlight. Can you use your energy and turn that flashlight on? Can you use your energy and turn that flashlight on? I can't use the candle for you to pull energy from it because the wind's picking up and it's blowing it out. We also have this device right here and if you come close to the device just pass by it you don't even have to touch it it will pick up your movement and set that off we have got um what do we have like five yes. different ones we've got five different ones around everywhere and if you can come close to any of them now if we're walking around and we touch it and set it off, we will let you know that it is up. But we've got them sitting around. It's dark. Oh. Now, I so heard something fall. Battery just went down half a, ba half a battery. No kidding? Yeah. Okay. You, you, what fell? I heard something the fall. The flashlight. Good morning. I probably knocked it out of there. <laughs> okay. So you think you knocked it out? Yes. Okay. So it's debunked. No, no spirits did it. That's not shame. Dumb. Shame. We need. We're gonna do this. We'll sit it like this. 
And we'll just put the candle here with it, even though it's off. Um, if you can turn that flashlight on, we would really appreciate it. All we want to do is communicate with you. We mean no harm, no disrespect. No. We apologize if we're stepping on your grave. The grave site, we apologize. We really can't yeah, tell what's what. what. Um, let me turn this off. So that, see, turn this around over here. So that you will know that we are in the pitch dark. Can you turn that light off for one minute, Jennifer? So you can see we're in the dark. Go ahead and pan around so they can see it's completely dark. So you can see we are in the dark. We cannot see anything. If there's any spirits here, will you communicate with us? Just leave it off for just a second. We're in the dark. We're going to leave it off for a second just so that maybe you're more comfortable with it being dark here. I am digging out the ovulus out of my pocket. <laughs> Can you set off any of the Hello. <laughs> Can you set off Ooh. any of the I'm gonna get you. I'm going to turn the ovulus on. <laughs> what? What? Oh, I forgot it scans through words. This is an ovulus 5B. It has a vocabulary in it, a vocabulary bank. Can you search through those words and communicate with us? We would like to hear what you have to say. Can you repeat again? Is anyone here that wants to communicate with us? Hello. We mean no harm. We're not here to cause any trouble. We just want to see if you will communicate with us. We know this is an extremely old cemetery and you're probably just used to being here by yourselves and nobody here to bother you. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. We're going to go ahead and turn the camera back on. Whoa, I was looking at it. When it I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to home. Are you just not turning the camera on? No, the camera was on. Oh. I just had the light off. Okay. Can you speak to us? It says date and work. Can you speak to us? Is there anybody here? Can you walk around any of our devices to to what? It says work, date, and to. We know we did have the date to come out here. Coco was was you off today, Coco? Yes. She was off today, so she was not at work. Can you communicate with us? We have some more devices over here. If you can come close to them. If you have a device over here, can you come close to the device? Can you touch the device like this? Change the setting. Can you do that? It makes a music tone. Y'all are not very talkative today. That is pitch dark. <laughs> that vine right there on the tree, that's a poison ivy. 
Mm -hmm. What? That's on it, so just stay away from that tree. That tree right there, that big, huge, fat tree with that big vine, that's poison ivy over there. It's like attracting all the bugs. Can you talk to us? I'm not yeah. saying anything. He's a big We drove a bit of a ways to come over here to pick up our crew, the spiritual searchers. Can you talk to us? Can you come close to these devices? Touch them? That's me. Or yeah. even bug. Sorry. <laughs> or even turn on the flashlight. That's me. Okay. Let's see. What did it say? I bet you're the one with the good ears. <laughs> Here, let's switch so you can hear it when it talks. This is a um, K2 EMF meter. If there's any spirits, can you come close over here? My can you make these I'm lights good. light up? Okay, go and turn it off and we'll change the battery. Now it's recording. How do you turn that? Now? What? We do have a flashlight oh. in there. Alrighty. He said he saw a flashlight down in there. What? What's it saying? What's that thing saying? I can't tell because. Okay, you have a recording, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, we've changed the battery. The battery was drained. So now we're going back in. They just said they'd get rid of us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give us some kind of excitement. Yeah. Watch your step. Now my husband's in the vehicle. He said he saw a light down in here. So uh, we don't know if he's really telling us the truth or if he's just talking with us. We personally did not. Oh shit! Oh, yeah. Well, that help. <laughs> Look at the wind blew that on the ground. What see it? it? No. Blew what on the ground? That the reflection from that up there. See it? Where it was oh, moving? Yeah. And I thought something was gonna get us. <laughs> oh, a shadow. Yeah, yeah. It was started over there and it come this way and I was like, oh shit. Well, you know the flashlight is out here. What did the flashlight come on? No. Oh, yeah, the flashlight is out here. That turd. Hello. Anybody here? No, the flashlight is right there. Okay, so let's, Holy be, hell. let's like not talk for one minute and see if we hear anything. Footsteps, anything. Let me turn my flashlight off. Well, I stepped on a long stick and it came back at me. Oh. <laughs> it's scary. Well, that stick is haunted. <laughs> Can you turn the flashlight on for us? Where is it? Can you turn the flashlight on for us, please? I know sometimes it takes you a while. You might not even know what a flashlight is. Sometimes, if you were, if you've been here for a while, yes, you may have known it as a torch, or you may know it as a lantern. I also have the EMF reader out. If you can get close and make all of those lights light up, please. Something just moved right over there. Hear me? Look, something just moved right over there. But I don't know what it was. I just moved again. What? Not this wide tree, but the next wide tree behind it. Can't see anything through this. Try to move over here and see if you can catch it in a different angle. Let me take my uh, light off so I don't want it to be. Is anybody here? Can you talk to us? Hello. 
See how you feel all the breeze in here? But out there yeah. on the road, it was hot and muggy. It was dirt. It keeps going off the ground. We notice it's pretty cool back in here and windy. Hello? Hello? Can you touch or walk by any of our devices and set them off? If you set them off, we promise you not to be too scared. It may startle us because we're not expecting it. But we won't be scared. Can you talk to us? Can you touch this EMF, this K2 meter, and set it off? We can hear dogs barking in the very far background. You sound pretty far away. Oh, it's so windy. You say, is that still on? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nobody's communicating with us. Can you pull the words out of that vocabulary bank? Hello. You gonna talk to us? <laughs> Tombstones in here that's very low to the ground. We have to watch where we're walking so we don't trip on one of them. Oh no, we have a ton of them at the house. He knows what a lightning bug is. I'm going to take out my phone. See right over there? That's just one for that lighting moment. We're up in the same spot <laughs> twice. You can hear the guys talking. <laughs> I am going to. Um, I got some new pockets. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to Okay. Okay, so the camera's going. Camera's going. We have it dark. I want to see. Hey, there's still light. Oh, it's infrared. Oh, yeah. I have the laser grid on. There you go. If there's any spirits and you want us to see you, will you walk in front of this laser grid? What it will do is it will. As you are walking past or standing in front of it, it will knock off the lights in the background. If you are in front of it, it will just pick up your shadow. Doesn't pick up very well. Oh, I see yeah. it better now. Okay. It does look fucking now. If there's any <sighs> spirits here, can you walk in front of this laser? I'm holding it perfectly still, and it looks like I'm, like, moving. It looks kind of weird back there by that tree. Where I thought I saw a shadow earlier? Yes. Yeah, and even though the wind's blowing and stuff, it's not anything blowing. It's just blowing inside here right now. Yeah, what I saw earlier was like a shadow, not a movement from... Oh, I just saw it again to my right. I almost, I'm going to move this just a little bit. It's like they're peeping, something's peeping up behind the tree. Yes. So I'll move this that over to the... That tree? What? Oh, I see, I'm talking to the girls. Oh. Don't be afraid. We're not going to hurt you. I spotted you and I see it again. 
I have no idea where you're talking about. There's well, like you can't there's see like a my... Void in the, there's like a void in the... Yeah. Like... I'll get away from that and take a screen. Oh, okay. Well, I've when I'm not looking through the camera, I can see it so much better. Okay. Yeah, you don't have to just stare if you got it in the general uh, deal over there. But right where those back trees are over there. Oh, yeah, you can't, I see what you mean. Yeah. Do, the, do you have night vision on that thing? It's, uh, she's got it on night vision, right? No. Yes. I figured it would. Oh, no, the night vision makes it worse. Could you see it on there when you turned on okay. night vision? No. No. All right, I'm going to turn it off. I wish that these would have a little deal on them that you could just like push and lock it in place, but it doesn't. So after a while, it starts hurting your finger. Okay, this is what we're going to do next. It got my brighter over there. My, huh? Isn't it brighter over there? Yes. Yeah, where did that trees. come from? Okay, so I can turn the, yeah, go ahead. It did get brighter over there. Huh. Okay, I'm going to turn this. Oh, this is weird. I'm going to turn my phone on. Let <laughs> me make it sure. It goes like all the way over red like that. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I'm just making sure my phone Jeez. is turned on, and I'm making sure that thing. the EMF is not picking up anything off of my phone here. Oh, I go home. I'm I have Google. it on. I have it on. Um, can you hold this for a minute? Yes, I can. I have it on airplane mode. I am going to put it on recorder and see if we can pick anything up on the recorder. Okay, put it over here so they can see what we're doing. Okay, I have it on the record. It's on airplane mode. I'm going to push record. Is there anyone here with us? We mean you no harm. Can you communicate? Can you tell us your name? We know the names. We know the names of a few people that is buried in here. Okay, now we're going no. to play it back. Let's play it back and see if we hear anything. Okay, let's hear it now. Is there anyone here with us? We mean you no harm. Can you communicate? Can you tell us your name? We know the names. We know the names of a Who few did that? people. That I didn't see anyone you recorded. <laughs> Play that back. I swear I didn't say anything while you were recording. To the end right there. Yeah, because that's when I said, uh, asked her to turn it around. I know that was freaking weird. Let's make sure that. Play that again. Okay. We're going to play it again. <laughs> that was kind of freaky. Yes. <laughs> let me it? say because Annette was goofing around earlier, you know, but she was obviously letting you know it was her. This time it wasn't her. Is there anyone here with us? We mean you no harm. Can you communicate? Can you tell us your name? We know the names. What the hell was that? We know the names of a few people. What the hell was that? that? Was that was me. Oh, was that you? I don't remember the dog barking. Oh, okay, that was a net. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on a net. That was like <laughs> the dog in the distance. And it said, no. <laughs> okay, so we know that was a net. All right. <laughs>
We'll turn this off now. Put it back in my pocket. <laughs> I should just let it go. <laughs> Did you guys think it was No, something? because they know we're telling the truth. No, I'm playing That's for you. I oh. mean, to play with you. Oh. <laughs> What's that lot right there? Wait a street light. No. There's a street light here? Yeah, just over there. Street light. Oh. Okay, so here let me. Saying. No, I was talking. It is even nothing to me. Which one? It's up. Can you repeat yourself? Here? I said here. Are you here with us? Was that you, your shadow we were seeing over there by that tree? I know I saw it several times. I one saw time. It too. Okay, so Annette saw it too. One time I might question myself, but I saw it several times and Annette seen it. Was that you over there by the tree? The shadow that we caught? I don't know if Coco caught it on the camera or not, but I know I saw it with my eyes. Annette, you saw it with your eyes? Yes. Can you talk to us? We mean no harm. We're going to walk around here for just a little bit, see if we can pick something up. Uh, it that looks like a flying cockroach. It's a moth. There's no roaches. There's no roaches. There's no roaches in here. It did look like it. <laughs> They've been on me because it's light. I can't see anything. Whoa. Oh, right here some of uh, deals. Can you turn this flashlight on over here? Sure would like for you to turn this flashlight on. Through this camera, it looks like it's on. <laughs> well, it's pointing. That blue light. What I'm Blowing going to do light. is I'm going to turn the flashlight on. Maybe it's easier for you. And you see, can you see it? Mm-hmm. You see if you can turn that flashlight off. And I'm just going to do this to see, just in case they touch it, it'll roll off too easy. Um, let me move this. Because if they, like, happen to knock it off or something, I want to be able to say, okay. So, Coco, get over here for a minute. So, as you I can see. Yeah. Okay. Can you turn that flashlight off? Coco, you gotta be over there. If they turn it off, you won't see it. Please. <laughs> she goes on the side of it. <laughs> Can you turn that flashlight off? Can you use your energy and turn that flashlight off? I'll turn this and see what time it is. 9.44. It's already 9.44? How long have we been out here? Over an hour. What did he say? He said an hour. hour. He said an hour. hour. <laughs> huh? He did say hour. I said he said hour. Sound like it. <laughs> did you hear? Did was that what you heard too, Coco? Yeah. Yeah. I yeah, said so how long we been out here? We been out here that long already? A little over an hour. And over an hour. He said an hour. <laughs> well, now that you're talking to us, I was already thinking about heading back. Was it you? Here earlier, letting us see your shadow. Can you turn that flashlight off? We're not here to bother you. Are we bothering you? We're going to fix them to be leaving here in just a minute. If you want to tell us something, now's the time to tell us. Do you want us to pass any messages off to any of your relatives? Is there anything you want us to tell anybody? Okay, well, we're going to let you go. Bye. Bye. Have a good afterlife. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> Hey, uh, yeah. 
Now they're starting to talk. I just started to reach up to turn it off. What did he say? They are here. I'm they are here? I don't know if that's what he said. Oh. Anybody could watching be, the video, tell us what you that, heard. It could be a female oh. ghost. We could, we could be offending her by calling her a man. Is it a female in here? I reached up to turn it off and then you started talking. Are you a male or a female? Hey, maybe um, his friend's dad or grandpa? Who's buried here? His grandpa Sisters? and his sister. Can you give us a name? Can you tell us your name so we will know how to address you correctly? Annette said we might be offending you. We don't want to offend you. Well, we're going to go ahead and we will say goodbye again. Bye, Coco. See you later. <laughs> see you later. I'm home. We'll see you next time you come out. Ghost hunting. Okay, you can go ahead and stop the recorder, please.